Well, we'll see you guys later. Go on and write down the things you want to do. Well, look tonight, we're going to go have a conversation on how we're going to have this talk with Super Final Wars. So who got who got enough money to buy the drinks? What the what the hell? Oh, come on, guys, you're gonna make me broke. I don't want to spend all my money to, just to get you all drinks and food and video games and movies and the girls. Oh, wow, you all are really sick. You know that. You're just sick. Oh, and uh, don't forget, hot anime girls. We need them. Hot anime girls. Yeah, you're sick, you know that? I hope you know that. I hope you guys know that. Shut up and get them or I'll kill you. Hey. Out of all the mistakes I've made, joining this weird army is one of them. Sorry, God. I hate myself. Dude, it'll be easier for all of us if you just get the stuff so we can throw a big party. Yeah, but... God, no! Well, that went easier than I thought. Yeah, I can already tell by the time we... time that you and I go to our separate rooms, we're gonna throw a party. Considering I can hear them arguing, I think the legendary Kaiser to literally use all of his money to get them food, drinks, movies, video games, and of course, very hot anime girls. Hey, guys, get some for me! Alright! You're sick, you know that? Hey, you, like, made out like 400 last year. We don't talk about that. Did you even get any of them pregnant? No, I... No, I did not. Oh, you used, uh... Yes, I used that. Good thing I whispered it to you here, otherwise this video will get demonetized. Yes. Good thing they did whisper in my ear. Although it would be nice to actually have some kids. You know what? Now that you think about now that I think about it, it would be nice to have kids. I was like, you know what, this might sound surprising, but I was actually thinking about asking Super Final Wars ex girlfriend Rapunzel out on a date. Or I could actually disguise myself as Eugene and do it. And, you know... Nice! You'll be doing Super Final Wars a huge favor. Oh, yeah. No, you know what? That's... That... That... That should be the conversation. If he doesn't believe me, I'll just say this. Alright, then. I guess I won't disguise myself as Eugene and... And make out with Rapunzel 500 times for you. There to leave you alone. Or even better, I can actually... T disguise myself as you so I can make out with Rapunzel. So 500 times. Oh yeah, he'll definitely have to agree with you on that. He'll definitely call a truce. If you can keep her distracted and get her to leave the, him and his team alone for that long, for a long time, then man, you will be doing him a huge favor. Yes, I would. I'll be doing him a big favor. So, oh, the big question is on how is we're going to get inside. So I'm fully aware that Super Final Wars' robot counterpart are already set up the security system. <coughs> Simple. We'll text him. Text him? Yeah, text him. We'll text him and see if he's interested in talking to us. 
All right, that that could work. Yeah, and then the problem is to having a conversation with Superfinal works without, you know, having him, like, accusing that, or assuming that we're just trying to make a plan to, you know, ambush his friends. Again, I can always come up with that idea. You know, the part where I disguise myself as Super Final Wars and make out with Rapunzel like a bunch of times, damn, getting her to leave him alone. Well, that could work, but but we might as well use that as a last resort. I want to get him to understand that we need a vacation. I'm pretty sure he needs a vacation, too. We could all use a vacation. Because I'm just bored of just doing all this villain stuff. Me too. I'm bored. Part of it too. As much as I like being a villain, it, it's just... It's just the same old thing over and over and over again. <sighs> so I might as We might as well just... Take a vacation. <sighs> so, how should the conversation go? I think it will start as simple like this, like something like, so, well, it's fireworks. Have you and your team been itching for a vacation? And if he replies, yeah, why do you ask? And if he rep and he'll just simply reply, how about we just call for a truce? It's for real this time. And if he still thinks we're making it up, then we'll be completely honest with him. We'll, we'll just go, look, we have been tired of this war. This war has been going on for years. I know we've done some things that you cannot forgive us, we understand that. And we have sort of no regrets. I have a few regrets. What about you? I also have a few regrets, but not really. Anyway, let's continue. And we have been losing a few good soldiers here and there. And, well, we recently heard that you're getting married to Orr, so congratulations. So, since you will be going on your potential honeymoon, well, after your wedding, So, if you want to raise your kids for a long time, or at least until they're like at least 20-ish, then you'll, re you'll have to consider our offer. And if that doesn't work, then you come in. I'll go something like this. Alright then, I guess I won't, won't turn... Disguise myself as you and make out with Rapunzel 569 times. Okay, Jesus Christ, that's a lot. <laughs> It'll make her so tired that she'll pass out and go and sleep for five weeks. 
I can only just imagine the look on his face when he turn when I say that. He'll just be like, "Okay, you got a deal. You got a deal. You got a deal. Just please, please do it. Do it for the love of God. Do it."